My name is Sophie Nicole, and this is Ark Survival Evolved. The beverage of choice today, let's get my timer going. The beverage of choice today is Blue Label Name Brand Cola. Oh. And the plan today, at least to begin with, is to go to the Redwood Forest to the north of here and uh, install one of these. The wooden tree platform and a tree tap, tree sap tap. You may see some element dust and electronics and stuff in my inventory. That's because literally moments ago, while I was waiting for daytime to arrive, my dinos here completely wrecked a tech raptor. Uh, and Andrew harvested the tech raptors. So, we have that. Um, yeah. Uh, tech dinos drop element dust and uh, scrap metal and stuff. And the scrap metal can be turned into metal ingots. Let me get rid of this. Um, so, it's handy to hold on to that when you find it. I added this also, by the way. I don't remember if I mentioned it at all. And it's going to be very, very, very slowly generating cooked jerky. And jerky has a huge spoil timer. Uh, and also feeds you just as much as the regular cooked meat. That's nice. It also apparently weighs the same, which is odd, considering, you know, turkey has water in it and jerky does not. What is going on here? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I had some, some stuff cooking. That's right. This, I'm going to mostly stuff into here. Uh, apparently, I'm not going to most of the stuff that I'm here. Okay, maybe I am. Um... Okay, a good chunk of it went in here, and the other I'm going to put in here. Because why not? I don't know what the ratios are. Uh, I think it's kind of, sort of, more or less one-to-one. -one. If we run out of something, we'll notice it later, way later, and get it sorted. Okay, that's not what I want. That's what I want. Oh, I did adjust the dino uh, stamina values. I doubled them uh, in the settings, which they were at. 1.0 and another at 2.0. Um, there's a purple drop over there and I want it, but my gold is over here. Uh, that's too far away. Okay. is over there. Now. Well, okay, I've lost the tree cap. Okay. And now we have a safe place to land. And yes, this is way bigger than I thought it was, which is a good thing. Uh, the tree cap was kind of expensive, which is unfortunate. Um, and it can hold 20 sap. Uh, 
but it takes a while for the sap to generate. It takes like 20 minutes per sap or something ridiculous like that. And we could put more taps in this tree and it would generate at the same rate. So you'd still only get one sap per 20 minutes or whatever it is. But you would also get uh, more storage space, which is the trade-off there. Um, but I'm not going to do that right now. I'm just going to leave it as it is. Also, uh, I did a thing with my weapons here. I now have the long neck rifle for tranking things, and I have the fabricated uh, firearms for my primary weapons. So that happened, and I... That was rude. And I uh, crafted... I used a lot of my gunpowder crafting just a shitload of ammunition. Like, I have multiple hundreds of ammunition of each kind. Um, so yeah. Now that this is built, uh, <laughs> I don't know what, what to do from here. I still actually, I still want a spino, and I never did get around to making that happen. So let's go up this way. And see if we can't find a spino. Ooh. Is it safe over here? Are you a brontosaur or a diplodocus? If you're a diplodocus, then this might be a poor idea. The broncos are and I'll take the same bro. I'll take a large storage box. Um, Broncos are not terribly uh, aggressive, but the Diplodocus, Diplodocus, however you pronounce it, they do tend to be pretty aggressive. Like, if you get near them, they're going to just wreck your shit. So, I'm hoping I can find a spino over here. It looks like there are some Gallimimuses. I assume that's what those are. Some flyers, some stegos. I love how Back when we couldn't do anything about it, there were spinos and tyrannosaurs and shit everywhere. And now that we have a snowball's chance in hell of taming one, they are just fucking gone. <laughs> like, what the fuck is that? Spinos are going to be near water, generally. They like to swim. What is that? Is that a carno? Carnotaur? That looks like a carnotaur. And it's fucking wrecking that moose. Well, it's not a moose, it's some kind of elk, whatever it is, I don't care. Uh, there's a big old bear there, too. Uh. There's a lot going on over here, and I'm not sure I want to even attempt this, especially since I'm not a huge fan of carnotaurs. 
Is that a Sasquatch? What the fuck? Oh, what are you? Gigantopithecus. It's a Sasquatch. <laughs> I didn't know those were in this game. Is that another Carnotaur? It is. He has horns. Lots of flyers. Uh, more than a couple of Gallimimuses. One of these bastards. Megaloceros. Yeah, I hear you. Some sheeps. I still don't see a Spinosaur. Have I just flown past one and didn't notice? Oh shit, there's one. Let's find a safe place to camp out. Is this, is this good? Can he get me from here? Twenty six. Oh, Jesus. I need you to not use the sauropod as a meat shield. <clears throat> you know, what? I should probably let him just beat the shit out of that sauropod because if I go down there, the sauropod is going to like. be aggressive. I missed. I missed again. This is slightly frustrating. Let's go down here. I don't think he can get it. Ha! Ah, but he can get me if I fall down! Huh. Fucking moron. He's just wrecking shit over there. Ah. Uh. Am I underestimating the drop from this distance? Or is he just moving too much? There we go. That's a solid hit. Don't run away! What are you doing? Come on! Mother... Fucker. Okay, Bradley, you're in the way. Where did he go? <laughs> Is he unconscious in the lake? Is that what's happening here? Oh no, he was just outside of viewing range. <clears throat> we might be making a mistake getting this close on this particular rock. But we're gonna try it anyway. What is around him over there? A bunch of... Not hostiles. Damn it. Let's keep this 
has to be complicated, doesn't it? I know damn well this isn't a safe spot. Especially when I'm down here. But maybe he's too distracted to aggro on me. I'm really an idiot. Okay, well, this works. Are you a different spino than the one I was- Yes, you- Oh, Jesus! There's two! Uh, that's not great. Do I kill one of them and keep cranking the other, or what do I do here? What is my duty of care? That other one is over there just having a grand old time with the uh, dinos over there, and I can't seem to hit him. Looks like he might be unconscious, or possibly dead. I can't tell if he's alive or not. I'm pretty sure he's dead. So that leaves that one. Don't, do Don't kill him. You can knock a Spino out using these Trank darts because I've done it before. I just don't remember how long it takes! Oh, Jesus! No. Are you... Hey, don't kill him! Bruh! He doesn't have anything in his inventory. Where's Bradley? Damn it! Fucking wasted. another spinal over here and it's bright fucking red. Um this is not a great spot. Well this is definitely not a great spot. Oh, 
he's gonna come around here and fucking wreck us. Oh, there's a raptor over there. I need you to finish what you're doing and not eat me. And also not get eaten in return. something here. There's a loot box over there. Are you a male? You are a male. Saber tooth salmon. His face is in the water. I hope he's not going to drown him, shit. So, what should we call the spino? It's a male spino and it's bright red. Good call him big red. Nah. I don't like that. I know what I'll call him. I know what I'll call him, if he ever tames at all. Am I going to need to go find some, some, some poop, some, uh, narco berries? I should have brought some narcotic with me. to call you Big Wrinkle. Wonderful. How have I ruined it? Yeah. That is a cool name. Listen, Big Wrinkle is powerful and strong. Uh huh. Uh huh. I'm sure he's place I'm not expecting. <laughs> he can only carry 350 pounds. He's fucking huge. He's he should. He should. He should be able to count, uh, carry 10 times that. Mm. This Hesperornis looks very excited about this uh, spinal being here. Uh, Bradley, where, where did, there you are. Um. Hey, Big Wrinkle, I need you to follow us. Don't, uh, don't get lost. Good boy. So this is the part that might take a little while. 
getting back. Especially if I'm flying and he's not. Because, uh... He, uh... He needs to keep up. There is a loot drop here, directly in our path. Not really, because we're not going the right way, but we're going to take it anyway. Are there any tech raptors down there? I don't see any. Hey, Big, hey, hey, big Wrinkle. Sickle. Oh no, I wanted to pick both of those up, not drop them. Okay, Bradley, have you had a good rest? Oh, there's a Tyrannosaur over there. I have already spent enough time taming things, so I'm not going to Uh, we're going to go around this way. How's that? No, around that way is the trouble. Let's go this way. We all know from Jurassic Park that Spino can take on a Tyrannosaur. Okay. Swamp is up ahead. There's a beehive there. Um, we are going to have to go through the swamp. Oh! Jesus! Scorpius gonna hurt my babies because one can fly above them and the other can wreck their shit. I have been poisoned, however, but it'll be okay. We will survive. Gloria Naylor has arrived. Gloria Gaynor? Gaynor? I think it's Gaynor. Okay, now... Come on, man, keep up! Ah, uh, that's kind of a drop-off. You'll figure your way out. Go this way. Hey, where, where, where did you go? Where are you? Oh, there you are. You, you got around us. I see. Oh, what is that? Is that a terror bird? I don't actually know. Uh, where's home? Home is that way. There's a loot drop over here. Well, I hope Big Wrinkle doesn't get fucking leached. Oh, 
want to be able to reload. So I went ahead and dropped that blueprint because it's a laser blueprint and I think we have one of those. Okay, you, you're joining us now? Cool. Uh, let's land and see what your condition is. Ah, uh, you're at full health. And you have... Um, so we killed some fish, apparently, and I don't know what the rest of it was, but whatever it was, it's dead now. Um, yes. Uh, Bradley, I need you. Yes. You have the right idea. Now, which way is home? I know it's getting dark. This way is home. And yeah, I know we're sort of flying fast for the big wrinkle there, but he, he, he's a big boy, he'll catch up. See? Knocking down trees the whole way. You can make it. There you go. Okay. Just a little bit further. Now is this gonna be one of those like... It's a big fucking fuck off cliff? Wrinkle can make his way up here though. Can't you? Where'd you go? Come on, man. There you are. Alright. Yeah. You're gonna have to find your way around, sort of, moments. That's okay. That's okay. Let's go right ahead. Home is here. Yeah, see? Yeah. The top of the fucking... Refining forge, industrial forge, goes through the... So that's more than five minutes high. One unit or something. That's dumb. Okay. You. Instead of destroying my house. Stay. We will we will make a saddle for you. Uh later. Chill out, meet the rest of the guys here, and, uh... Meet the rest of the guys there, and, uh, we'll, uh... We'll see you next time. Um, I have a bunch of stuff that I need to put away, and I have some meat that I need to quickly cook before it goes bad. Uh, 
That's why this industrial grill is so great. It cooks 12 at a time and in half the time. Okay. It's already been longer than it would like to have gone, so I'm going to go ahead and call the episode here. Next time, I hopefully will have made a saddle for Big Wrinkle, and uh, we will, uh, we might go do some, uh, cave diving in, uh, well not cave diving, but we, can, we won't be diving. Um, do some, uh, go into some caves and see what we, what trouble we can get into. Um, I think that's what we're going to do next time. Um, see if we can't find a cave. Because I know about where one is and I can never find it when I want to. Uh, and then there's a different one, but that one is way more dangerous uh, because of tyrannosaurs and uh, raptors and such. So, you know, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll see what happens. For now, this has been Ark Survival Evolved.